So, what were Apollo and Athena doing at the time? Let's find out! So it immediately kicks into them running from the from the guards. That's kind of interesting. I was expecting that you get a different investigation and you'd eventually find out why they were running from the guards, but anyway. <laughs> uh, maybe try and go into Dirk's old law office? Spider hair! Spidey hair! <laughs> you know what? Yeah, let's not explain that now. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's because of the Founder's Orb. Yeah, Phoenix should not have told Garan that he was Dirk's son. That was a bad idea. <laughs> and yeah, we get to... So what happens if we do this? <laughs> well, now, um, now we've just exasperated things for ourselves. I think I'm pretty sure where we need to hide. But I wonder if there are some funny things if we investigate stuff. Yeah, let's try the manhole. It has to be. Oh. Yeah, because that's your priority right now. Former Sadmahi Law Officers, now it has a new name. Yeah, it looks like it had another door at one point, but it's been barred. Ah! Why are you using the same hideout twice? That's clearly not a good idea. <laughs> what? Oh, what? Phoenix is there? Okay, so everyone's here. And that means Edgeworth's likely here too. Oh, by the way, real ostriches don't do that, apparently. Okay, evidence transfer. I had a feeling that someone would uh, inherit the other person's evidence. <laughs> yeah, hotel. Uh, yeah, is he gonna... Who's gonna tell him that it's a rebel hideout? Yeah, I wonder what Dirk knows about this. I have a feeling it used to belong to, a uh, to Amara. Painkiller... 
and Inga's notepad. This is really, really strange. Like, this... Hmm. Why would he need to keep notes on Nanya? This is all... I have a feeling I know who that is. And then there's that. <laughs> I see. Well, only in this game would someone use a former law office as a safe house. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we have darts here, then. Okay, what do you have to say about this place? Yeah, he just had other things occupying his attention. Though if I'm right about a certain thing, this is going to get a lot sadder. <laughs> What about the Founder's Orb? And just the same shout. What about Apollo's biological father? Nope! What about this? No, you don't know that. Pretty sure Dirk is the one who knows about that. Know who this is? Nope! Okay, let's just examine stuff. So that's Dirk's old law book, and it's in the photo. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> okay. In the name of the Queen. Who is right there with a dagger in her. certain things that we do definitely need to look at here, but... Ha <laughs> ha! 
Yeah, that must have been pretty terrifying. And these are Darth's favourite lizards. <laughs> Duck season, rabbit season. <laughs> kind of funny that Phoenix is here to comment on Apollo and Athena's antics. That <laughs> kind of does. What about that sign there? Sadmahi Law Offices. Yes, it did. Until one day, a Derpa Derpa Defense Culpability Act happened. Okay, so they still called him the Defiant Dragon even back then. Maybe. Well, Apollo's no stranger to wearing eye patches. <laughs> and she began literally ruffling, most likely. What about this little shrine here? They're still keeping the flowers for the priest, aren't they? Ah. Oh. Yeah. Garan claims that it's keeping the peace, but it doesn't seem like that's true. Athena, you can't recognize what is clearly Apollo? <laughs> Was that the day that they almost drowned? Yeah, something clearly happened to him. Oh, wait a minute! Unless that... Unless that person that they have stuff on that... That they... The person that... Oh, unless... If Nanya is... Is... Amara... And Inga figured that out... Maybe he was threatening her... And maybe that's getting... 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 Nayuta on his side... That would make sense. Anything else to examine in here? Looks like we've checked pretty much everything there is. Oh, wait a minute. Except for the Amara assassination case files! Yeah, the one thing we came in here to do! Page 1. The arson innocent... Um, in... Uh, the arson in incident involving Amara's private residence. Amara was slipped a sleeping pill and perished in the fire. The lighter found at the scene had Dirk's fingerprints on it. Okay, that's not good. Oh, but if she was slipped a sleeping pill, then divination silencing her would not... would not really do much good. Unless that's a convenient cover-up for the fact that she's still alive and divination seancing wouldn't do any good anyway. Okay, Apollo's roving musician father got caught up in this incident and lost his life. He was struck in the head by the culprit. The victim's passport and any pictures of him were burned up in the fire without knowing his real name. No divination seance could be performed. Oh no! 
Oh, no, 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 no. That's not going to be good for Apollo's mental state when that happens. But obviously that's going to happen because Dirk finally found out his name. Yeah, I had a feeling he must have died in the same incident. So it looks like whoever the big bad of this game is killed Apollo's father. Yeah. No. Okay. Okay, maybe Dirk himself. I don't know. Okay, so currently we've only got... We've only got two pages, but I'm sure we'll be getting more eventually. What are we also... So, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to... Do you know anything about this guy? Yeah. So that a divination seance could be performed, definitely. Oh, we can also talk about Nayuta. Guess we unlocked that option from examining the picture. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Yeah, Dirk clearly knows because Inga said when Inga said that that Maya's not the only leverage he had, Dirk reacted. And I believe we're gonna Oh yeah. No. So what about the most awesomely named person in the history of everything? Okay. Okay. And the place got burned. Oh. It's just like the, uh, what happened with the, with Army's mother. Yeah, so how'd they find this? Okay. Oh! Mm. 
maybe. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. I won't say any more because of past game spoilers, but that does fit. That definitely fits. I mean, I mean... Phoenix is here. Okay, right. Anything else I could show this guy? The files, maybe? Yeah. Well, that's useful in case someone tries to burn this file. As the son of the terrorist Dirk, Nayuta was expelled from the royal family. Okay, that makes sense. The sins of the father of Israel is deeply rooted in the minds of the Koranese people. Oh! That's interesting! That doesn't bode bro that doesn't bode well for Rafer at all. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Dirk is not considered a good person around here. Yeah, he actually managed to do that. Except working for the wrong side. Hmm. Okay. Huh? Believe is here. Ah, oh, but Apollo doesn't know her. Ah, oh, she's helping sort out the cases. There's a lot resting on this. Hmm. Yeah. Let's just hope it's not a particularly violent one. Yeah, this is really, really bad. What about the window? Oh. Dance is a pretty good escape artist. But this doesn't bode well. Because that is probably going to be a key piece of evidence at the trial. Maybe we should. Yeah. Phoenix is joining us? Okay, Edgeworth's gonna wait here. Yeah, probably a good idea. Hmm. So I guess we have to go to the detention center. <laughs> the critical role fan in me is going, okay, you'd better all roll really w well for stealth on the way out. So, what do we got going on here? Now I think about it, Dirk has kind of a mark as well. Hmm. 
Oh. Oh no, that took his dragon's eye, and now he can't use it to get four press turns! <laughs> anyway. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, he didn't. That might have been a symbolic gesture, because we know that's the dragon's eye. To show the world that a dragon always gains four press turns. And then something happened to the user. Huh? A symbolic gesture then. I wonder if that's going to be what we have to present at the end of the case. If no user's feeling really bad and we have to show that to him. Oh yeah! There was something that we needed to show him, wasn't there? Do you recognize this butterfly pendant? That's Amara's, isn't it? Something you bought. What? Record of it remains. Okay. That's a little suspicious that he's not explaining where he got that. Yeah. Can you explain the full story about this? That's the thing. Yeah, I wonder if, um... Oh, he's being very evasive. Or an old lady is still alive. Uh, <gasps> or Amara is still alive. Or Rafer is your daughter. Two possibilities there. Oh, his arm was moving when he said, but she's gone now. That's it. 
Kinda wish you could fast forward these though. So it's pretty still here. But then when he says, but she's gone now, it's moving. Gotcha. Amara isn't gone, is she? Dirk? Ooh, okay. Wow, he's... He's got multiple layers of this. What is that? Gotcha. What is that? Right there. No. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> no, this was from many years ago. <laughs> there's a fingerprint. There's a fing there's a clearly visible fingerprint in that. I'm sure that's got to be important too. That has to be. Yeah, I figured this out a long time ago because of the hair being similar to their uses, but... Why did Inga have this in his safe? Yeah, no, it's not possible because of the Defiant Dragons book. Because of that book right there. The Defiant Dragons are newer than that. Which means... Amara is still alive. As I thought. And I think I know who she is. There we go. Which means that that murder he was accused of wasn't just a false charge, it wasn't even a murder. How did she survive? Oh. Yeah, it must be. 
So yeah, we are not going to be able to do a divination seance in Amara. But again, if we try, I get the feeling they'll say, oh, she was drugged with sleeping pills, that's why we're not getting an image. But in fact, she's still alive. So Amara's not really dead. Why would Garan try to fake her death, though? Yeah, that's what I was wondering. <laughs> uh, Athena's a romantic, I see. So, I wonder if that fingerprint is in fact a preserved fingerprint of Amara's, and he's keeping that so that we can use it to prove that a certain someone is actually Amara. And I think I know who Amara is. But the real question is... Yeah, I'm still... maybe wondering about my theory. My theory of, uh... My theory that... I was about to say someone did die in that fire, but... We know that Jove did, but... I wonder if someone else died in that fire. And I wonder if... It's really crazy, but... and sad, but... It's definitely a possibility within the realms of... of Karain. Okay. Oh, so she suspected that he might have. No, I wonder if they hid her in plain sight within the palace itself, or, or if she got out and she disguised herself as Nanya so she could be closer to, so she could be closer to Rafa. Probably is. He's having to choose between his father or his mother, basically. Oh, I get the feeling that won't end well. Yeah, is that Sadmahi? <laughs> yeah. Who is that baby? I get the feeling he's gonna say neither. No, I don't think it's Sadmahi either. Hmm. Yeah, he just said it's not you. Uh I don't think Twenty-three years ago, Rafer is only fourteen. Why do I get the feeling he's going to get cut off before he says something like this? Is 
Something important, huh? What is this something important? No bracelet, he's telling the truth. Oh, I think it might be exactly what I think it is. He said he can hear the Twilight Realm calling his name. That doesn't sound like... That doesn't sound like he's ha he has a terminal illness. No, I think... I think... Ah, uh, I think I may be right. I think I might be right about this. I think this is beyond cure. No, I think what he's already got is... Pretty much beyond curing. Ah, uh, Dirk was was just too awesome to live because maybe he already yielded a long time ago. No, yeah, that'd be a bad thing if they found out. So yeah, Apollo not only has to defend his father for massive charges of treason and murder and stuff, he then finds out that he's dying. Of course, of course a protagonist in this series could not have had a... It's the it's it's the it's the it's the series mentor curse all over again. I keep saying it. Mentors in this series always end up either dead or evil. There are no exceptions. I knew it. They they spent so much time getting attached to him. I knew that it was not going to end well. But I think I think yeah. I think it. I think it, 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 it ended a long time ago. No, yeah, he has one more thing he has left to do. and bring down the real mastermind behind it all. Of course there is! Yeah, I think I might have an idea what that secret is. Truth that is difficult to accept. Mm, I don't think so. Oh, and of course, in addition to all that, the revolution is getting started.
Do you have anything to say about any pieces of evidence before we go? Oh yeah, that line now has new significance. I think we've shown some of this already. Actually, do you know anything about this mysterious bloodstain? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that we've already got everything we can out of him. You probably have something unique to say about this. Yeah. What?! No, don't! Don't, Athena, no! <laughs> oh, I... People... People... People are gonna have... Have... People are gonna do things with that. Yeah, I don't even want to think about it. this. Nope. Know anything about Inga's notepad? No. Okay, let's just examine, because I get the feeling this may be the last time we're in this detention center, so... Let's see what they have to say about this guard. What about the bell? <laughs> yes. The answer is yes. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. Right, now let's move. What are we in for when we go here? I have a feeling it might be a full cutscene. Yeah? Ow, ow, ow! Let go, will ya? What are they... Huh? Well, look at that! The people are coming to take their courts back! <clears throat> Okay, that's pretty epic. Yeah, we've got a full-on angry mob. And there's no user. You, we know what they've got on you. Your mother is in danger. Yeah, the Royal Guard are probably coming. Oh no, not the DC Act.
Are we going to have time to say it? We are actually going to be able to talk to him. Okay, what about... About this. Well, you're not actually going to say anything about evidence, so I guess we'll just have to talk to you directly, but let's just try examining all this. Yeah, this is not going to end well, especially when I know the guards in the courtrooms are armed with... armed with machine guns. Ah, uh, because they... there just weren't enough arrangements. <laughs> okay, what do you have to say? Why are you prosecuting? I just had a thought, though. They said that Garan used to be Justice Minister. I wonder if they might pull a sudden prosecutor switch later in the trial. No, let's not get into another debate. Oh, yeah. And back to the Zen Monk Act. Yeah. I think I do, and it's about Amara. Has to be. Oh, no, obviously they are not. Or she's been Nanya all along. Hmm. Yeah, that's probably true. Who really killed Inga, and why? Yeah, it's our turn to save our father. What if Nayuta already knows? Maybe that's why you have that philosophy. Yeah, I thought we wouldn't be getting any more out of him. Yeah, he was going crazy. Oh, we might actually be able to mood matrix someone in this trial. No. 
Uh oh. Wow, the investigation is not over? Okay. I was fully expecting the investigation day to end there. Okay then, uh, I just want to check something. Can we still examine the pool? Yes, we can. Yeah, pretty much. And well, the trial is definitely going to be dirt. Look at all these locations! But I guess we need to go to the audience chamber. Why do I get the feeling this is not going to end well? No guards. Let's hope we don't get captured and uh, forcibly interrogated over the orb. Yep, that is Rafer. Yeah, good thing we overheard that. <laughs> I think I know exactly how her mother deceived her. I actually punched him. <laughs> oh, of course. Phoenix is kind of used to abuse by this point. <laughs> And considering in Ultimate Mole vs. Capcom 3, he is pretty accustomed to being punched. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, don't show that picture to her, don't show that picture to her, don't show that picture to her, don't show that picture to her! And maybe Amara is her real mother. She's certainly reacting as if it is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Snooping as usual, I see. Ah, uh, don't admit that. Sins of the father and all that. Oh, this is gonna end badly. Very badly. Please tell me we're not forced to present that photo. Do you know anything about Amara still being alive? <laughs> ah, Royal Guards are still here. Oh no, no! No, no, don't do it, Apollo! Don't do it, Apollo! Don't do it. Don't do it. This will not end well. This will not end well! Oh no. Don't do it. Please tell me you made a copy of that photo. Oh, okay. And Mara's alive with an exclamation mark. Yeah. No. Or, 
it would serve to dethrone you. I have a theory that you're not even the legitimate queen. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Well, about that, uh... Let's hope that she can't see Cyclox. <laughs> yeah, that was Phoenix who pointed that out. Hmm. Starting to wonder whether Inga thought that. If you had that, you could channel the Holy Mother. That's something that I've been suspicious of all the way from the start. Unless, though, unless Garan is not a real medium. That's another theory that I have. Maybe that's why she needs Amara alive, because Amara, maybe Amara can channel spirits, but Garan can't. It's definitely a possibility. Let's just say it's happened in families of spirit channels before. Uh-oh. Oh no, we're going to lose very important evidence, aren't we? Yeah, I thought this was a bad idea. Wow, they're strip searching him already? Let me just check. We still have that. We still have the photo. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Secrets that keep you in power, though. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, nice one! Oh, no. No. Yeah, pretty sure this is the end of our investigation segment. But, oh boy, Rafe is gonna get tortured, isn't she? <laughs> Apollo Shadow comes out. Anyway, uh former Sadmahi office.
Anything interesting happen while we're out? <laughs> I am now a fanboy of it. <laughs> or not, yeah, the opposite. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, um, Edgeworth's gonna really, really... Yeah, he's not gonna like that. Okay. Uh... I have to know. Is he? Dirk does want him to take over the place, and considering Dirk is actually going to die... So we've got two cases here. Yeah. Well, that is typical of final cases. Yeah. That is the million dollar question. Well, I do know that the real killer definitely killed Jove Justice, and if I'm right, they may have killed someone else as well. As well as Inga. Why would someone have killed Inga? I mean, I know that he was trying to kill the Queen and all, but... The Queen would have a... If the Queen is the one who did it, she would have, would have a much darker motive than just protecting herself from assassination. I'm sure there's something much worse going on here. Much worse. Exactly. Yeah. And we'll have to reveal publicly that Amara is still alive. It's gonna be a lot easier to clear him of a crime that never actually happened in the first place. Oh yeah, but yeah. Uh <laughs> Yeah. But I think we have one secret weapon. We have this guy's divination seance. I'm sure that's gonna be the key. We know his name, we know his face in that photo. We can do that. No. All of them. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, Athena, we might need your mood matrix. <laughs> yeah, that's a... That's uh, something that you don't expect to uh, have to deal with when you're just a lawyer. 
Yep, just like the trailer said. Yep. Next time, it's time for the trial. And I'm sure the big wham moments have only just begun. I'm sure there are some even bigger things that are come, gonna come out during the trial, but I think I may have an idea as to what one of the big twists is gonna be here. I have an idea. And while I've been trying to skirt around directly saying it, I'm pretty sure that I've made it quite obvious what my idea is now. So we'll see at the trial whether I'm right or not. See you then.